G'day, it's Paul here, and I'm with my old friend and my old boss actually, Eric Felgate and Bronwyn, his wife, in Adelaide, and Pauline and I are visiting them, and it's after 30 odd years or more uh, since we worked together amongst the homeless in Adelaide, but I've asked Eric if he has a favourite scripture, and so I'll ask him to share about it, and I'll hold the microphone behind my hat to hide the wind. Uh, for me, uh, John chapter 14 um, is a very uh, important um, scripture for me, the whole, the whole of the, um, the chapter. What I like about it is, and I can't read all of it, but um, Jesus said, let, Do not let your heart be troubled. Trust in God, trust also in me. In my house are many rooms. If it were not so, I would, would have told you, and I'm going there to prepare, prepare a place for you. So God, I, I know for sure that God is um, preparing a place for me and looking after me. But also what um, is important in John 14, um, Jesus identifies and he said, I and the Father are one. And um, to contemplate that, to think about that is just incredible. That God, that Jesus, in fact, was there from the beginning. And uh, if we think about that, that's very, very important. But also um, what's important um, in this whole uh, chapter, it says that if you pray believing, um, I will answer your prayers. And um, I discovered that as an 18 year old. I thought, what is this? And I thought, if this is true, uh, if this scripture is really true, how wonderful will that be? And um, I must say that um, I've tried to claim that through all of my, my life and my, my work for him and um, mostly with disadvantaged and homeless people. That's great. So, so pray believing and he will answer your prayers. Is yes, that what the promise yes is? that's what the promise is. And um, I found that, that he honours that as long as we pray believing. That's what a great scripture. Yeah. Fantastic to have promises that you can stand on believe in your heart and that's wonderful Eric to share that if you're interested in this open up John 14 and have a little contemplative study yourself you get into the word and let the word of God get into you so thank you Eric and Bronwyn for joining okay. us today we well, may God bless you and your beautiful pup which is called summer <laughs> very comfortable here from the autumn leaves of what's this suburb called McGill at McGill see you later now God bye now Bye. 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 God bless you.